The point is mannerless women and weak men. Welcome to the Mwega Show. If you've been watching, you know ninja watching, you have not subscribed and you have watched one, two, three, four of my videos and you like the content. So you just subscribe so that we can build the channel and then we can continue on this journey for more. Sindio, good, let's get into this. <laughs> this has been an interesting week. And this will be an interesting week for you people will be watching this video. Some of you will come out here thinking I have something against women or who hurt me or, you know, all these things, especially you people who like to use the sign language. But it is what it is. As long as you watch content. Me, you watch hate, dislike. You watch like, you will finish your like button. Sawa, sawa. Now let's continue. So now, Jana, um, as I was coming home, Panda easy, easy gari 45, sawa? Jitora 45. Highway, coming home. So, kange analipisha, uh, akapita, aka akarudi. Kumbe there was somebody who was asleep pale mbele. And when the makanga tried to kumuamsha mwitishedo, the guy akuamka. So, ayakamaza kulipa akarudi. This is something which I'm just watching, sawa? Um, akamwitishado. So, the guy wakes up and claims that I'm a lipa. Then the kange is like, melipa nani? Uliko melala ni kapita. And now I'm here back, na kutisha peso, na semo melipa. The guy anatoa 50 bob kwa mfuko, anambia makanga, nilikuwa na mia, nika kupea, ukanudisha hii 50 bob. So, wakabisha na kiasi, kulikuwa ngome inacheza kwa, kwa hiyo basi. Ukanga kazi mangoma. Plus the guy mwenye upiga, upiga debe hapo, cause you know, wana kwa like, at least wawili. Mojo wa kupiga debe kubeba na mojo wa kulipisha. So wa kupiga debe pia kafungwa mlango. Kauliza jamaa, eh, hey, do unatawa mautoi. So the guy starts causing. Nini, nimesha alipa, nini, eh, hey, the derea kasikia story, ya kagari kando, wakashuka. And now unajua kaderea mekuja na pressure. Akambi wale, ni, ni, ile kiti ya watu watatu. Akambi wale, na alikuko kwa, kwa diro. Kambia wa atu simameni. Deri haka shika mtu mashate hata kumrusha inje. Now this is where it gets interesting. Wamamo waka simama kwa gari. Wakaanza kupatia deri maneno. Nini usimrusha inje nini? I was sitting next to such a woman. She stood up. Now, you have to remember. These are two men. Or one man. So it started with two men. The, the, the guy who claims I'm a lipa and the makanga who claims I'm a lipa. Sawa? And then, the, the makanga is even asking these people all who are making a new job. You are making a new job. The guy is like, I don't know if I can pay for it. So the guy is like, and to be honest, there is no way me, me, kama ni meka na mse na I'm a lipa, I can tell the makanga that I'm a lipa. And there is no way two guys, two random guys, one is like, I'm a katu hapo, like, oh, na makango wame conspire kukuibi ya do. So the probability that this guy had paid is negative. And also the guy was drunk. That's why he was asleep. Women, kwa hiyo gari wakasimama, nini, nini, usimrushe inje. Uh, guys is like, mi nataka pesa. So women are like, si umpate yo 50, nini. It, it took like five minutes. Women shouting, including some dude who alikuwa na demi yake and the chick was shouting so he was shouting too most of the men were just quiet cuz ini kitu haini husu okay these are these are men having a disagreement about money and i told this cuz he was seated nyuma yangu like kwa hii mimi nilikuwa nimekaa kwa 2 sita so nyuma yangu 3 sita Nikambia jamaa, badala ya kurusha mdomo, toa pesa, ulipe, gari ye, yende jupale kesi ni pesa. The guy is like, hey, neza lipa, but hana, aja toa do. So, what is the point of this video? The point is, mannerless women and weak men. Mannerless women and weak men. Number one, weka mwanaume. If you are having a disagreement with another man, and it takes women to come and intervene, then you are weak. Wacha nirudie. For those people, wale wenye wana, wajasikia kitu nimesema. 
if two men are having a disagreement and it takes the intervention of women to come to your rescue, you are weak as a man. Sawa? If you are a man who is watching two men having a disagreement and you think it is unfair kwa hiyo disagreement and you can do something about it, especially kwa hii, which was about 50 bob, don't say naweza lipa. The guy, if he wanted to pay, this is what men do. Men stand up. You go there with 50 shillings. Unapea makango na mambia niaji. Unelipea yo jama. Kesi naisha. But this man was all about. Why? Because he had his woman. And his woman was already in his head. And this woman, amesha si mama. So, me was asking myself, who mama amesi mama kufanya? Paka amesimamu, kufanya. This is why you men, mabibizenyo anarudigi nyumbani, ati ametoka meandawera, anarudi nyumbani na madent. Because aliingilia vitia wanaume. Unasimama kudu. Do you know what standing up means to a man? A man whose who testosterone imeja. He, he is angry. Do you know what standing up means? You want to fight. Unasimama na mwanaume upigane na ee. Why are you standing up? But then, I sat down. As ye lifanyika pale survey. So before survey, na before ni shukisho nagari progi, that was a lot of time. That was like 20-30 minutes of me just sitting there and ruminating about this issue. And my question was, what made this woman seated next to me? And na alikuwa mumama, akukuwa mschana. What made her think that it was okay for her to stand up and try to intervene kwa story ya wanaume wawili yenye au wanaume hawamhusu not like it was her husband or her brother or her father or her son who was in trouble it was just some random drunk dude kwa mat what made her think that it was okay for her to stand up and raise her voice against Men who are already charged. Men who are already... Uyo jamali kwa mesha inuliwa. So you need to understand that whoever na inuana, he is ready. Because zata mwenye na inuliwa na ezarusha ngumi. Okay? So the, the mwenye na inuana ako ready katambe. Already... Hey, you know, men, we know how we feel when we, we want to fight. We don't see anything. We just see this person and what we want to do to this person. So I, I, I came to a few conclusions. Uh, most of them might be wrong or all of them might be wrong. So you will tell me. So comment, comment about, about this, this. So I, I, I came to a few conclusions that either this woman and all these other women who were shouting didn't have a husband in the house. So they on the wanaume. So yeye yeah, akisimama, yeah, simami kama wanaume, anasimama kama wanaume. Akona that masculine energy. And as how that that masculine energy does not translate into a masculine physique. That niki kwani hands are flying. That masculine energy will not assist you. So but she was in her masculine energy or they were in their masculine energy. So probably they don't have a husband in the house. And if they have a husband in the house, they have a weak man in the house. So that is what they do in their own houses. They stand up and challenge their husbands. And their husbands have let them do that. And that's why they are taking their mannerlessness that they practice in their houses and they take it in public. They take their mannerlessness that they, they practice in their own houses and they take it in public. That's why I said mannerless women. And this guy who was here shouting, oh, listen, this is somebody's business. Okay? Let us, also, let us just assume that the guy had paid. Mbona hawa watu wawili hawakuona? Cuz you see if you are sleeping na unaitwa and I'm seated next to you even if nilikuwa kwa phone because of the disturbance I will stop and maliza ile kitu mnafanya and I would have seen that transaction take place. 
two guys two men say that tujaona huyu jamaa akilipa listen and people will say that probably mimi ni sexist ama mimi ni misogynist whatever give me whatever term but i would rather pay twice than get women defending me Eh hey, sijakulipa si amjaona am nikimlipa eh hey, atujaona ukimlipa lakini nimemlipa brother mimi najua nimekulipa lakini ni sawa umenikula pesa na ni sawa now men you have to teach your wives who men are your wives some some wives out here don't know who men are because they are married to weak men they don't know who men are they think all men are their husbands and because unasimamaga unaguruma bwana yako anakaa chini utaenda kusimama ukute wale wanaume wenye hawagurumi wangu na wanawake hawagurumi wangu na wanawake and you and hapo ndio mali unapigagwa watu wakikuangalia because now utaulizwa okay ulikuwa unaulizana na makanga nini ni wewe ulikuwa unaitishwa pesa hapana si mimi na ni nini ilikuwa inakusumbua if you really wanted to help like i said is eh hey, msimurushe nje because alikuwa anarushwa nje ya gari because hakuna vile utaenda na gari yetu sare eh hey, msimurushe nje shida ni pesa shika problem solved everybody is happy that is better than hey hey hey, hey. namrusha nje kwa nini who you are like na akirushwa nje na urushwa nje mtasaidiana aje so men this is for men please talk to your wives kwa nyumba muambie just because you raise your voice at me and i let you don't go raising your voice to other men uko nje Men, 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 I am weak. Men are not. I am weak. Men are not. I am the anomaly. I am the one you can talk to hivyo. Sio kila mwanaume. Okay? Like, share, comment on this video. Alafu pia subscribe to the channel. See you on the next one.